What's going on everybody? Welcome back. John Boat Tournament, just like I told you. Filming and making a video of every single one for the rest of the year. Number six or seven for us? Seven. I think it's seven. Mmm. All right, Ace. You know what? I'm just gonna start small. Ace is throwing top water. I'm going Ned Rig. Oh, nice. Stay down, baby. That, first, idea. you want to go to the back? Ah, first fish in the boat. The Guggen Squad and Ketchco Hound right there. Shout out to Ketchco and Guggen Squad. Uh, I literally <laughs> haven't made a cast. Good job, bud. I guess it's your turn this week, eh? Ace is back for revenge. I saw a couple comments in there that said, oh, so you can outfish Ace every once in a while. Thanks, guys. I really wanted to have a good day and catch a couple, but now Ace is going to catch them all. Oh. <laughs> this is Billy's rod. I, I was like... Wait, I don't have a DC on, because I have this rod. It's a 746, his is a 744, but they, I mean, they look identical. Yeah. But I was like, wait, I had a frog on there and it was braid. I guess he either took mine or accidentally left it in my boat. <laughs> Got him. Yeah. Not small, but a keep. Yeah, I think so. It's gonna be close. Hey oh! Spinner bait. Spinner bait, man. First freaking cast. It'll be close. Yeah, let's see. I bet you he's good. Mm hmm. Oh, nope, I lied. <laughs> Try again. Oh, baby. Boogie's on. Good. Bring her in. Slam her on in, Ace. Oh yeah, good call. Oh, that's good too. Nice. Texas rig? Texas rig. Ow. Boogie boy with number two. The old Texas rig. Pit boss, right? Yep, pit boss. Sick. Was he just up, was he up shallow? Yeah. Right now we're just focusing on main lake points. Two pounds. Two pounds. So you're telling me the other one was bigger than that? Yeah. That must have been the lead weights I put in its stomach. <laughs> Let's catch one over Texas rig. Pick up a crankbait. That's the move. There he is. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> yep. All right. I guess it's Texas rig time. <laughs> You literally called it. You're like, catch one on a Texas rig, pick up a crankbait. You gonna come behind or in front? Come behind. Right. Oh my God. That's what I'm talking about. That's better. You guys are here for the Ace Boogie show today. I can feel it. Nice catch, man. Oh, you do? Yep. Nice. I hope keep. I bet you he's right on it. Crankbait? Well, oh, you called it, bud. I need to get it into the boat, though. I'm down. What? Did he? Nope. Oh. I lied. Ah. He's definitely gonna keep. Or, I don't know. What do you think? He looks like a keeper to me. Huh? I know, it's weird. He has a big upper body. Number four. For the Ace Boogie Show. Good one? Oh, he jumped off there for a sec. He might keep. I think he will. He'll be close. 
Yeah. Now you pull, I don't know. It's hard to tell. Yeah. Oh, oh baby, the Ace Boogie Show continues oh. number five. Good work. I told you, you're gonna catch a limit by yourself today. I'm useless, I just brought the boat. Small. He might keep. Oh God. Nah, he's, he's short. What were you saying about the drop shot? Here we got, I'm gonna say 13 and a, he's 12 and three quarter, okay, bye. Mm -hmm. Nice. Ah, damn, boy, take time. Risking it. Ooh. Well, Ace just completed his limit. Texas Let me just give a quick shout out to the guy at the gas station. <laughs> we did it. Uh, no, there's not much of a we there. You we done did it. Did it. We did. We did. I mean, I have been netting all the fish. You have. If I wasn't here, you might have been. Where I wanted to be. <clears throat> right. Oh yeah. First limit of the year, baby. <laughs> Time to cull. Did you really? I'm coming in for the culls. The money fish. If you did all the hard work, now I'm gonna have the fun. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it'll work. Keep it down, keep it down. <laughs> oh, that'll help. That'll cull. Pulling by 1120, which maybe not very impressive to some, but for us, pretty good. All right, everybody at home, 122 update. We got six fish, caught seven, got a limit and culled. We got about two and a half hours left and probably just stick to fishing around points and bluff walls close by. Is that all bait over there on that point or is it wind? We need to call a couple more times. I think we need some, some big bats bait. <laughs> Ten. Well, needless to say, it was a great tournament because Ace and I finally got our first limit of the year, which is a little bit embarrassing because I think that was our seventh tournament out there. Haven't done any pre-fishing this year, and I don't think that's really helped us out too much. Basically, we're going out there blind every tournament. And, you know, there's some guys that say, don't pre-fish because it's just going to hurt you. And then there's people that think pre-fishing is good. I personally have kind of seen the difference. I don't think that we've really been on top of the fish at all this year. And I'm hoping to be able to do a little bit more pre-fishing for the upcoming events. The winning bag for the tournament was 22 pounds. And then there were two more 20 pound bags for second and third. And I think we came in like 10th or 11th or something out of... 22 boats i think it was so didn't do too great unfortunately like most of the tournaments this year but we're still getting out there still having fun and really we're fishing all of these to qualify for the classic right now we're sitting in 13th place they take the top 15 teams and the next two teams that fish every tournament with the highest weight so basically if we get the top 17 we're good and right now we are in that cut line so 
hoping that it all turns out well. We still have six or seven tournaments left after this one. It was a really fun tournament being able to get out and watch Ace catch a bunch of fish and help him call a little bit. So not my best showing, but that's what I get for catching some in the last one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button for me if you're not already subscribed. Leave a comment down there below as well. We'll see you guys on the next one.